Welcome to Pocket Women Lock Picking and a Lock Sport. Wow. Welcome to my Lock Lab. Working on a Master Lock that I got from SE Lock and Key. Haven't fully set everything up yet, um, but getting there. My work trays, pinning trays stuff I'm working on coming up to my shelf of appreciation where I have people's stickers and cards and things my brass bits my unicorn, horses, cat, frogs tools, bits working on so yeah, here's my lock lab I haven't quite got the camera sort up properly yet. The lighting's pretty bad. Um, got shadows everywhere now. I've moved position, so you know, sort that out. Technical issues. But today, what I want to show you today, stuff I've been working on. Um, Ruko. I've got one open on that. No consistency, but getting a feel for those little gin bottles. got this silver rock from Chris Capoon oh, a long time ago never been able to get it open got it open for the first time this week pretty happy thought it was a flute tried to do it again yeah couldn't do it again but it's an open and it's open so it was a good practice session gonna work on a challenge lot but we're not working on it just you know film an open um, this uh, 410 Master Lock, Lotto Lock, I got from Mr. Paradise. Still have not been able to get an open on this one. We'll keep going. But today, we're decoding. Look at this. This is a Master Fortress, Master Lock Fortress. Now, I got this from a Swindler. Now, very fortunate instructions okay so a little light touch or it will slip the first number the shackle moves out a bit oh, it slips and one open yep so we know these numbers are 16, 38, 29, and going left is 10, 2, 29. We also know there's a two or three number leeway of uh, tolerance in these ones. So I'm not going to change the code. It's got instructions here on how to do that. Pull that off, have a little look. That's how you do it. So what we're going to do, put it on zero, yep, I'm going to apply a little bit of tension, so what do you say, just a light touch or it will slip, so just a light tension, alright so I'm going to turn it this way so I don't, can't see the dial, so it is locked up. So you've got to turn it to the right, no tension twice, once, twice, and that's to align the wheels at the back so they're all ready to go and apply light tension. Okay, I just felt a little give on the shuffle then. So I'm going to take that as a number. Put 
or give. So I'm going to go to the right now for the third number and didn't leave the third number. It was listed anyway. So between 31 and 32. And what was the number? 29. So there you go. Quite a, a lot of slot, a lot of tolerance in this. So um, that's how you do it. Thanks, Swindler. Excellent advice. Have fun with these. These are fun to decode. If you're in a country where lockpicks are illegal or you can't carry them around, you only can have them in your house, one of the good things you can do is get hold of some combo locks. Have fun decoding them. You can take them out in public, play with them, learn how to decode, do all that sort of stuff. They're a lot of fun. Now, this is the first one I've been able to decode <laughs> one swindler gave me i have a handful left i gave a lot away but um yeah so i'm pretty proud of this as my first decoded look so everyone thanks for watching hope you have a great week take care enjoy your weekend hug your loved ones pat your pets stay legal temptation is everywhere